I am Shanicia Allen. I'm 17 years old and I represent RSS Phoenix Youth and Sports Club. All right, I got involved in throwing javelin while transferring to RSS Phoenix and transferring to Roxborough Secondary. When I went to Roxborough Secondary, I tried sprints, but unfortunately I was unsuccessful due to knee injury. And then I decided to do long distance. Then I was successful for a while and after I stopped due to chest problems. And then after I was watching the Olympics and I saw Thomas, Thomas from Germany, I was like, I want to do this. So I went and talked to one of my coaches and he was like, all right, sure, you sure I can handle this? I said yes and then eventually I start throwing and then that was the passion right there I just take it off from right there basically and from that till now I just love it man well it's hard to say right now but hopefully yes I guess it's the passion for it. Man. I just love seeing it on TV and after that, it was a go from there. All right, some of the goals I want to achieve for 2020 is making it to Carifta Games, representing Trinidad and Tobago in the Junior Pan Am Games, and that is about it, and breaking my PB for sure. Some of the challenges our elite from Tobago could face from traveling to Trinidad for meets is financial problems, basically. The only thing I could say because some students or some athletes parents are not financially able to you know assist them assist them to go to Trinidad to compete and that could cause a major downfall on the athlete so yeah a normal there for me, I could say, wake up 5 a.m., had to catch the bus for 6, 6 o'clock to go quite to Roxborough. Reach there around 7 o'clock, training starts at 7, so we had a rush, change one time, reach on the field, warm up, stretch. If the coach is not there, we had to do it, you know, be ready until they come. Do, do we work out with drills after that? Run straight to the show around 9 o'clock, and we had to be in class by 9.15 for the first period and when we there school work and then after break we chill a bit um, come down to lunch gym time for an hour then after I run to the shower and we had to get to class for roll call and still have homework to do at the end of the day in the night <laughs> Basically, I love getting, being recognized by other people, especially other athletes from Trinidad. Um, recently, I have just met two record holders for Trinidad and Tobago, Cleopatra Borel and the female javelin record holder that I didn't even know was my family, but okay. And yeah, that is about it. Something I learned about myself is not to follow the hype. When you follow the hype, you'll end up in problems. Because when you follow the hype and you end up in problems, you alone have to find your faith to come outside. And it does be very hard. 
other than that, it's cool, man. Time management between school and training is very hard on some days because you have a ton of homework to do, depends on how many subjects you're doing. And then you had to stay up late hours at the night doing homework, studying the next chapter for the next day or for the next subject we're coming. And then after, you still had to wake up the next morning early to do training. And then after that, just a repeat for the whole week. Some advice I could give to a young athlete are be determined, be motivated, and don't do it if you don't want to do it. Make sure you have a passion for it before you do it. And be confident in yourself. Don't let nobody talk down on you until you can do something and show them at the end of the day that you could do it. So you also find me on Instagram at Shanicia the Troll. You know Shanicia dot underscore the troll. And yeah.